What up, y'all? It's so cruise. Y'all already know what it is. You ain't gonna ask what it was. Come on, my page. Talking on the side. I'm gonna talk about the other people. 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 I'm gonna talk about the other we're going to be talking about how to tie a do-rag in 2020. If you got 360 waves, 540 waves, 720 waves, hybrids, whatever you like, bisexual waves, if you need to know how to tie your do-rag, we're going to get you straight. And how to tie the do-rag without getting a do-rag line. It's 2020. We're starting off a new decade. I don't want to see nobody with do-rag lines. If you see any elite waiver with a do-rag line, send them the link to this video. I'm about to show you how to tie your do-rag and not get a do-rag line. First off, follow me on Instagram at Real Sir Cruz, R-E-A-L-S-I-R-C-R-U-S-E. If you can't find me, then you got blocked. Stop talking stupid, you wouldn't get blocked, okay? Straight to the point like a dot. Tell your mom my new shoes are thought. You hear the bars, right? Now let me back up. Now we're gonna get the base right. We're gonna get the base. We got we got the base, right? Let's see. We're gonna get this line straight crack down the middle like a butt crack. Straight down the middle. Butt crack. Just like that, right? Now we you wanna stop. Now this look crooked on my end. Let me see. It's kinda hard trying to look at the computer. Okay, but y'all get y'all get the gist of what I'm doing. Okay, just kind of pissing me off just a little bit. Hey, I'm getting real pissed off. Where my phone at? Am I right? Okay, let me let me. Oh, y'all get a peek of the ways real quick. Y'all see me spinning? Let me try this one more time. Let me get it right because I'm a little sick right now, so I'm kind of off. Let me, man, fuck this. Let me look in the damn. Oh, that nigga look fucked up. Damn. damn, I could get this shit right to save my goddamn life. Okay, we right down the middle now. We right down the middle, right? Okay, now we back right. We got the crack. We got the butt crack, right? Keep it just like that. Right down the middle, right? Put both these straps over your head. That's like you're tying a shoe. Bring them both over. Now, this do this method is all about keeping the, keeping the tension off your forehead and onto your head. So, this first line, you never want to press any line on top of each other. This first line, should this first strap should be over this one. It should not be pressed on this one because the tension from this one is going to press on the tension from this. That's why half y'all waves look better on your forehead than your head. So first off, you want to make sure this is flat, not crumbled up. So make sure this is flat all the way across, right? Then you bring this second one up. The second one should be 0.5 inches above your hairline. So my hairline is right here. This is where my hairline is at. So you want to bring it this one right, just a pint like a salt salt inches away from your over your hairline so my hairline is right here so you want to bring my hairline is like right here you want to have this line above the hairline you don't want it under the hairline because it's going to cause a line on your forehead that's why half y'all waves look better on your forehead than your head because this is going to be pressing on this middle line so you want to bring that one over there and then put that right there kind of keep that still and then you bring this line or you bring this strap and you bring that one a little bit over that one. So this one this one is guaranteed to not cause you a line. This one can give you troubles if you don't position it right. And this one can give you troubles if you don't position it right. So the main thing with this is to make sure that these lines is not on top of each other. That's why half y'all waves look better on your forehead than your head. Because if it is, that's why half y'all waves look better on your forehead than your head. So you're going to get you a do-rag line. So bring it to the back like this. Come to the back and tie like a shoe. See both of these right here? Tie it just like a shoe. It's the last step. Get this tension off your forehead because it should it should be a little tight right here. You don't want that. So you want to yank this a little bit. Yank this up. See how You see how it's loosening up? It should be loose because if it's like this, you see how tight that's looking on my forehead? If it's like this, you're going to get a line because there's tension. That's a tension mark. These do-rag lines is basically tension marks. So if you got this tight on your forehead, it's going to be tight. And it's going to, that sounds stupid. If you got it tight, it's going to be tight. If you got it tight on your forehead, there's going to be a tension line, a.k.a. a do-rag line. If you, got this too, if you got this line tight, this second row, if this second strap, if this second one right here is, put, is too tight on top of this one, this is going to press in on this line right here. That's going to give you a do-rag line. So this third one is basically no worry at all. So now if you want to add an extra layer of compression, <coughs> get you a booboo -boo cap. Booboo -boo cap just like this, right? Oh, that looks stupid. Why you think you had you have never seen me with a do-rag line? Bring this booboo -boo cap. This this is wrap one, right? You want more compression? Flip it again. That's two. Never bring the booboo -boo cap down here. That's the whole purpose of these being separate. That's why half y'all waves look better on your forehead than your head. 
never bring the booboo cap down here because this is this band is pressing on this. You want to at least bring the booboo cap up here with this one, this second row. So the booboo cap should be up here with this one. That's how it should be. Don't worry about no style. Don't worry about style because style will get you a do rag line. How you gonna have how <coughs> how you gonna have style and killer ways with tension marks on your forehead? It's a lot of waivers that got dark marks from years of abuse from pomade, years of abuse from not washing their head, years of abuse, years from abuse of the do rag line not being taken care of. So do it right. And then the last one, you don't want you don't want to look like you Superman. So get this strap right. And that's it. So you never want to put no lines on top of each other. That's how you're gonna get the line. Now this don't look bad right here. This don't look bad. You wouldn't see me in public and be like, oh, that nigga look fucked up. Look at that. Come on, man. So you see what I'm saying? Like, can y'all see that? Let me let me tilt down a little bit. See what I'm saying? So this is how you don't get do-rag lines in 2020, everybody. Make sure your lines is all separate. One line, make sure there's no tint. It's not too tight right here. Bring this second one just a little bit. This about this much right here. You see that? Just about this much. You bring your dude, this second one this much above your hairline. You don't want it pressing right on your hairline. You want to be right above it. And then this third one, a little bit up there. You could, you could bring this one down just a little bit if you want. You could bring it down just a little bit, but, you know, never press it on top. Never press one line on top of another. So, you could bring it down a little bit, but as long as there's no line pressing on top of each other. So, you see that tension is off my forehead. No do-rag lines, I'm telling you. How, how's it going to be a do-rag line? There's no tension right here. Look at look how loose that is. Why would I need the, Why would I need tension on my forehead when I want the tension on my hair to lay it down? So, that's why half of y'all waves look better on your forehead than your head. So... That's what I'm saying, bro. Bring that hole right up there like that. And bam, you out of there. No do-rag lines of 2020, everybody. Send this video to all your favorite elite waivers. Tell them. if, if send, Only send it to them if you see them with do-rag lines. Appreciate y'all for watching. If you can't find me on Instagram, your ass got blocked. Tell your mama to step on my cock. You already know what it is. You're right. So the world's coming my page talking about the side of your neck. I'm going to block you because I don't tolerate the disrespect. You already know what it is. Ring it back to the woods. Get up off my phone, man. Let's go.